What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I got a package from Funko from a previous pre-order and I got some sodas. Let's get into it. Uh -huh. Before I get started on the video, I do want to say thank you to everyone that has liked, commented, subscribed, follow me on all social media platforms, and on the Collector Chatter podcast. We are trying to grow that channel. We want everybody to check out the channel at least. Give it a listen. It is a great listen, especially if you're into Funko. Want to know what's going on in the community. Wanting to know so much more leaks, news. I know SDCC is coming up, so stay tuned for that. Go check us out on the Collector Chatter podcast, on YouTube, and on Spotify. And don't forget, here, specifically on South Texas Collectibles, I am on the road to 5,500 subscribers. I'm going to give away this signed Giyu Pop to one lucky winner. So if you're not subscribed, think about hitting that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell. That way, when I do hit 5,500 subscribers, the giveaway video will be notified to you. And once it's all said and done, you will be notified once I go live. And I will give away that pop to possibly you if you are watching and subscribed so again guys thank you so much on to the video all right guys today's video i have a package that i pre-ordered i think the beginning of the year i want to say it was like february or something like that and then also i did pick up some sodas from five below so sodas package sodas package Let's just get into some sodas and let's see if we can get some chases. All right, so I got my big bag from Five Below. We got a continuation from my previous video where I opened up the Sanderson Sisters. I have Winifred, Sanderson sister. Go ahead and put that right there. I got two of them. Actually, no, I'm lying. I got three of them. We're gonna try to get this chase because I really like to complete the set. Also, I did get a Sarah Sanderson because unfortunately I got the chain or the common. So I got two. Hopefully we pull them. And not only did I get that, I got this pretty cool Ninja Turtle, Leonardo. I only got this because in my back videos from probably almost a year ago, me and Carly opened these up and the sword was broken. So I definitely had to pick this up. This is pretty awesome. So now I can add that to my collection. And then I did pick up, let's throw that over there, two of the Hercules sodas, as you can see here. So let's see, what are we gonna go with first? Let's just go with Winifred. Let's go with this one, all right. So again, I'll put a picture like I usually do of what the uh, Common and the Chase look like. I believe, again, these all kind of look like gummy bears. So yeah, hopefully, I believe Winifred is green. I'm pretty sure. I, again, I'll put a picture. So yeah. Let me know, have you guys gone to Y'all's Five Below and found any chases? I know a lot of people are finding the um, Shazam chase. Other than that, what else, what other sodas have you guys been finding? So, all right, here we go. Three, two, and one. All right, cool, so we did get the comment. Of course, you do need the comment to complete the perfect pool. So this one looks really good. I do like this one a lot. Uh, the details on these sodas all right definitely awesome all right so let's get the pog out like we always do kind of put this down here or back here all right so this is going to be one out of 209 or 2000 20, 900. i don't know why i couldn't talk today all right so we got one all right we got another let me know if you guys have pulled the chase on this thing um I feel bad for the ones that bought these on the Funko Shop because they're like five bucks. Have five below. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. How funny though, right? Like if I ended up, because there was a lot. And when I say a lot, at least like cases of these. All right, here we go. Three, two, and one. Okay. 
So we got another comment. We don't need to see the pod. We've already seen it. Oh, guys. Man, oh, man. All right. Last can for Winifred. Last can. Okay. Now my other video, I got a lot of chases. Go check that out. I'll probably put one of those little pins on that. But, oh, man. That was a good. That was a good. I'm glad I got all those chases. All right. Here we go. Oh, you gotta shake the pog. I call it a pog. Some people call it a coin. Uh, maybe because I was a 90s kid, that's what I grew up on, pogs, because that was the shiznit. That was, that was, you weren't cool unless you had pogs. So, all right, here we go. Please, 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 please. All right, here we go, three, two, one. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh my goodness, let's go. All right, so two out of the three Sanderson sisters have been completed as far as the set. Oh, oh my goodness. Let's go. All right, so we'll go ahead and show the pod. This is going to be one out of 4,100. Let's go. All right, so... All right, technically we're one for one because it's the same soda, so. All right, so now we have Sander Sarah Sanderson. We have two of these now. Like I said in my previous video, I did get one because they only had one. Um, I believe they, I don't really remember. Yeah, they only had one, so I went ahead and picked it up. What were the, you know, just to see my off chances. All right, so. And I believe this one, she's green, purple. I want to say she's purple. All right, here we go. Shake the pog, shake the pog, baby. All right. Oh, it's already kind of slightly up. All right, shake the pog. Can we get the perfect, technically, would, would you consider that the perfect Perfect pool, even though I got three. No, it's not the perfect. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. All right, so we did get another comment. Okay, we've gone through this before. This is going to be the, probably the same piece count. Yeah, one out of 20,900. Okay. Are we going to get the chase? Let's see. I really want to see more sodas too, by the way, from Funko. Uh, I love sodas, to be honest. As you can see, I have my Ninja Turtle stuff. I have more back there packaged up. I'm hoping to display very, very soon. Um, I love soda so much. It's so funny, I don't drink soda, but <laughs> I do like these sodas. All right, last one. Now, if I don't get the chase, should I go back and buy more? Let me know. Let me know, guys. What would y'all do? Because it's only they're only five bucks, so technically I already spent retail for one. All right. All right. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Oh. Okay. So we did not get the chase. Sarah's not open. It looks like Sarah Sanderson does not want us to find the chase at all. And that is upsetting. All right, so now we have the Hercules. This is limited to 12,000 pieces. As you can see here, this is what the common and then the chase, I believe is on this side, what it will look like. I don't remember if this glows in the dark. It could, I don't remember. So let's just go with this one. All right. Um, okay. So I'll put a picture, like I always do, of what the common and the chase are. I got this one because I, I remember when Hercules came out. And it's funny, right? Like whenever you think about stuff like that, when the movie came out, you're like, dang, that was a long time ago. <laughs> Now I'm like, oh yeah, I remember when that came out. 
It's pretty funny. Shake the can for good luck. All right. Let's see. Did we pull... I feel like I would know the difference between the common and the chase because it's a different mode. So... All right, here we go. Three, two, one. We got the common. Okay. So we got the common Hercules. This one actually looks pretty good. I like this one. This one's actually pretty detailed. I like it. All right, here we go. Let's see the pog. Oh. Let's see the pog here. Now, this isn't an international one. I pulled some international, or I had the international Lotso. I ended up pulling the chase on that one, which is still pretty cool, even though it is an international. But this one is an actual, like, U.S. soda. So as you can see here, this is the pog. This is going to be one out of 10,000. One out of 10,000. Okay, last soda. Are we gonna pull the chase of this last soda? Why is it, he looks like he's leaning. <laughs> All right, last soda. Let's see. Oh man, man, oh man. Man, oh man. Uh, okay, I'm gonna shake this pog up. Alright, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ah, so nervous. Alright, here we go. Three, two, one. Alright, so this is the regular common again. Alright, so unfortunately we got one chase out of so many sodas. Oh, this is great. This is great. Alright. So I'm gonna try to go on the hunt for that one. I'm gonna try to go on the hunt for that. All right, so we got two Hercules chase or commons. Still pretty cool. Let me know if what you guys think about these. Um, have you gone to your five belows? Let me know in the comment section down below. So move on to the next thing, and that is gonna be the package that I pre-ordered back in I want to say March, February. Let's get into it. All right, so this package here. And it's funny we call it a package because this is technically, to me, this is a sort. And it's kind of scary that Funko, Funko Brands, is sending pops in sorters. And I get it, sometimes they are a little bit more durable than a box because I've seen pictures of this specific pop get completely damaged. And I don't care if it's in a prop protector or not, but when you see like dents like that in the corner, it kind of makes you worry because you spent a good amount of money to pre-order this. And granted, yes, it was for a good cause. Um, but still, you know, like, I don't know. Maybe that's just me. I know I did a good thing by buying this because it was going for a good cause. But still, as a collector wise, like this is still to me, like, if it is damaged, hopefully it's not. But if it is like still that, I don't think that's fair that Funko or right that Funko does that. Let me know in the comment section if you totally believe me or agree with me. Um, like I said, this pop has been, this actually went pretty viral back when it came out during the Super Bowl. Um, and it is none other than the infamous, oh, look at that, it came in nice little packaging. Uh, the infamous Kelsey Brothers. Now this isn't Travis, this is the infamous Jason Kelsey, which, might I add, has a very nice beard, just like myself. Dang, this thing looks amazing. Now, I'm looking to see, make sure there's no damage on the case, but this is amazing. Look at that thing. This is pretty cool. This, I do like this pop a lot. Um... Obviously, this is a very iconic moment during the Super Bowl where I believe Travis Kelsey made a touchdown. Jason Kelsey just yelling out in the air. I'll, let me just show you. Open! Kelsey has the touchdown! Well, you see the busted coverage here, but you lose him. Oh, there's his brother. He says, right on, that's Jason. All right, so that's basically, that's, honestly, that is a great moment. He probably had a lot of beers. It was super cold, 
but overall that is still pretty cool that Funko listened to us and said, okay, yeah, let's make it. The only cool, the only difference from the original post that Funko did a long time ago is that originally it said Funko on his chest. Now that would have been pretty funny, but you know, I get it. They want to make it close as possible to him. But this one, honestly, I like this one a lot, very, very much. He has his beanie, which he was wearing a beanie. It does have the Funko crown, pretty cool. Has his joggers and he has his boots. And then of course, the infamous beer. This one is pretty cool. This is gonna be number 82 in the icons. I do like how he signed it basically right there and then also in the back, as you can see. This pop is definitely amazing. Um, I don't, oh man, I know I went to a fundraiser. I don't remember what, I went to somebody. But overall, I'm glad that they did it to, you know, some fundraiser or donated it to a family. I don't, I wish I could remember. This is literally, this literally just came in today. So I didn't really do too much research. I just was like, oh man, I finally got it in. I'm super glad. Um, but let me know, did you guys get this? Did it come in damaged? Cause like I said, I did see a lot that were coming in and damaged, um, just completely just shredded. Hopefully Funko gets them another one. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how that works, but overall, this was super cool. I'm going to definitely keep it in this pop protector. Wait, if this one has that little dent in the bottom or that little divot, I don't know what you would call it. If not, I'm going to take it out. But um, overall, super cool pop. I'm super glad to get this. Let me know if you guys got this. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media platforms and follow me on the Collector Chatter podcast on YouTube and on Spotify. That way... You guys will be notified of leaks, SDCC news, what our opinions are, what our thoughts are, um, what's going on in the community. Um, we definitely, I would love to see that channel grow very much. I believe in that podcast very, very much. Um, and if you go, let, let them know I sent you. Or let me know that I sent you, because I'm going to be over there as well every week. I'm going to be going live occasionally with Charlie and Migs or with charlie or with migs or just by myself i don't know but let me know in the comment section on here and over there what you thought about this pop this sodas and don't forget to like comment subscribe follow me on all social media platforms i'm gonna make sure i'm gonna give away this signed pop so i am on the road to 5500 subscribers spread the word if you know somebody that's a demon slayer fan send this video send the channel that way they can subscribe I want to give it away to somebody you know i believe that it's a great pop it's a great signature you know so yeah again guys thank you so much and we'll see you on the next video